Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Let me figure out where the road goes Hey y'all! Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. I am so glad to have you here today. Thanks for watching. So today I'm going to have a all day cleaning video. My mom and my sister were actually going to be coming over for the weekend. We were doing some work on the shop and asked for them to give us a little bit of help. So we are prepping the house today to get it ready for having people over. I needed to clean the sheets as you could see. On this day, I have a ton of laundry to do because of that, because I have so many sheets on my bed. Um, but it all looks cute, so it's totally worth it. But yeah, we are just going to have a whole bunch of cleaning today. I'm going to start out with cleaning the bedroom and then go into the living room, dining room, clean the bathroom, kitchen, and then take you along with just some random laundry. I hope that you enjoy today's video and that it brings you a lot of motivation, and let's get into it. Falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down So as you can see, I decided to go ahead and dust in our bedroom. I really don't like doing it, so I really don't do it that often. And it obviously very much needed it. So I went ahead and did that. And this is Chris's nightstand that I'm starting with. And as you can see, this cord does not agree with my shorts. And this is so funny. My shorts, this tassel actually gets stuck another time in the video and I'll go ahead and slow-mo it down for you but I just can't believe that my shorts kept getting in trouble and I also dropped some stuff while I was cleaning in the living room and it was just a very clumsy clumsy day so that is why you're going to be seeing not only some cleaning but also some fails in today's video <laughs> even if you try you wouldn't understand it maybe something's missing inside So it felt so good to film a video in my brand new laundry room and I still cannot get over how this laundry room has turned out. It is so functional and so awesome and as you can see I am really getting into being super lazy with doing laundry and just leaving it out as I'm doing this voiceover. I have more laundry that has been folded and hung up but needs to be put away. So as you can see, I am definitely enjoying this laundry room and definitely enjoying just taking my time with it. And please don't judge me for the state of this closet. I am very obviously not showing you all of it in this clip because it's a disaster in there. 
and I am really at a loss as of what to do to make it better except for just the full remodel that Chris and I are planning. So it's probably going to be a complete disaster, a complete mess until we get around to being able to remodel and get this closet to just make much more sense. love-hate relationship with this coffee table. I love it in the fact that we got it super cheap and we were able to fix it up and make it match our credenza, which obviously they are two very different pieces and two very different styles, but these little ridges hold on to everything. They are so hard to clean and I am still battling with how to clean it. I think I'm just going to have to take a paper towel with a knife and just go and get in those little crevices and clean it, which is really, really frustrating because it, with it being a coffee table, we are touching it and using it all the time, which means that I have to clean it all the time. So I'll probably go ahead and do a deep clean of this later, but for now, I was just going through with the Dyson to see if I could get all the little crumbs out from in that ridges. be wrapped around your arms instead of being lonely we could be gazing at the stars but now it feels just like i wandered off into a room and closed the door behind me i never gave the key to you even though i wanted to i should be trying something new but now my body's aching i'm tired of dwelling in the dark it's just that my heart can't take it so I don't know if you can see in that second bedroom that there is stuff all the way up to the door. With the shed being torn down, the laundry room being gone, well not, not gone, but <laughs> the storage room that used to be my laundry room being gone, up oh, and here's my fail. <laughs> But with the laundry room being done and it no longer really being a storage place for Chris's tools, the shed being gone because we are working on building the shop, that means that not only is everything out on the deck, which if you remember my complete disaster, Chris and I organized all of that, but it's also in my other bedroom and it's just... It's everywhere. So we are really trying to push to get the shop done so that we can kind of have our deck back and our second bedroom back. So hopefully that will be happening very, very soon. You will definitely be privy to all updates. But what I was showing you with the paint and the stain, I have a very exciting video coming up. I was able to find a old pedestal table um, at a online auction and it is just perfect for my mom's kitchen. She and I have been talking and I got that set up to go ahead and redo a table for her. So I will have that in a future video. So subscribe if you are interested in seeing how that table turns out. I could be wrapped around your arms instead of being lonely. It should have been you Another time, another place, I just know You could have been the one who made me feel home What a crime and what a shame to let go Ooh, it should have been you Another time, another place, I just know I just don't know what to do It 
Okay, so I just got back home. Um, had to get my hair done. Got my uh, roots touched up. And I always forget, you got that little piece of evidence whenever you get your roots touched up. But because I was in town, Chris wanted lunch. So I had to come bring him lunch. So I was getting all that done. Oh, alarm, hold on. Okay, so alarm is off. Um, yeah, so got my roots touched up. Went to a salon this morning to get that done. Um, so yeah, you're gonna see the little halo all day long. Um, had lunch with Chris and now I'm back. I gotta get everything done because my mom and my little sister should be coming over um, probably pretty soon. So hopefully I can get this all done before they get back. I need to finish the laundry, get the bed made, and then we need to go ahead and get the bathroom cleaned. So Oh, and the kitchen. The kitchen is a mess. <laughs> Let's get into it. You better turn up. You better be there when I shake. Watch me rocking if I can't stop. If I should fall, just go ahead. Go and catch me, baby. curious the blue cloth that I'm using is actually a glass and mirror cloth that I got from Target I cannot remember the brand of it to save my life but I went shopping at Target and got a whole bunch of different microfiber cloths the bathroom ones the teal ones that I use in the bathroom they actually have little scrubbies on one side as well as the microfiber on the other side and then this one that I was using for the glass cloth it's kind of like a paper towel. It, it really helps make it streak free and I use the Grove Collaborative, um, just their brand of glass cleaner and the concentrate and I really like that combination. I have been looking at the E-Closs though just because I'm curious. Apparently everybody loves them so that would be kind of fun to use so I'm looking for those as well but just to let you know that's what I'm using instead of paper towels. All right, like I've said several times I try to keep a little bit more of a waste-free home. <music> Among the flowers, we just let the days pass by. 
People would tell us to get a grip of ourselves And get a job, we didn't care what we were told Cause when we were younger, we used to sit on the grass And go, damn, I don't wanna grow old I wish I could turn back time Mm-mm Stay up all night singing songs on the terrace We didn't mind sitting out in the cold It was impossible to make us embarrassed We were free So the one downfall from having a complete brand new sparkling laundry room is that we closed in that door that used to be to the carport so now I have to walk through the front door and go around the car to take out the recycling but honestly I could care less because this laundry room is just to die for. If you did not see the makeover or kind of why we had to do it, um, I will go ahead and link that in the cards above so that you can check that out. But we had to move on. Life ran away from us. If I could go back, be 17 again. Yeah, I would just to see all my friends. Running around the city acting crazy like we used to do. Ooh, ooh, do, 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 do. I wish I could turn back time. Oh, ooh, ooh. Stay up all night singing songs on the terrace. We didn't mind sitting out in the cold. It wasn't possible to make us embarrassed. So here's the method of uh, floor cleaners that I really enjoy using. It's in the almond scent. It's just the spray and mop. And I really like it just because it is really simple and it smells amazing. This almond scent smells exactly like our wedding cake. And whenever I first used it, Chris was like, that smells like our wedding cake. So it's kind of cool to have that scent and to be able to use that in our home. And I am using my brand new mop that I got from Grove Collaborative. This was my first time using it. It is the microfiber mop and I really like it. It's definitely different from my Swiffer. Uh, the pads stick a little bit differently to the floor but I think that it cleans a lot better because it actually gets the dirt off. That's At least that's what I think. Um, so I really enjoy using this one. I have been looking into the O-Cedar mops though. I like that with those you can clean off the baseboards as well. So we'll see if I go ahead and splurge on that one. But for now, I am enjoying this Grove Collaborative mop. So as you can see, I have a lot of sheets that I have to wash whenever I clean the sheets on our bed. But what I do is I do a little bit of a rotation. Um, so I do the sheets and the quilt on one week. And then the next week I do the sheets and the comforter. And I always clean, I always wash all of the pillowcases just because we are obviously using that. But with the comforter, we really don't use it that much. We just kind of fold it and it gets kicked off in the middle of the night. The quilt is really what needs to be washed. So that's why I am not washing the, the comforter this time just because I go on a rotation and also because it really does not need to be washed as much as the quilt does. So you've made it to the end of the video. 
this is it. I spent all day cleaning. I know I left a little bit to get my hair done, but pretty much spent all day cleaning and got the entire house ready for my mom and sister to come. And as I'm saying that, I realize that they come over a lot. <laughs> We're a close-knit family and my husband and I really enjoy having people over, so they definitely are always welcome. But that's going to be it for today's video. I hope that it brought you motivation and inspiration just to work and clean on your home. I hope that if you were able to clean alongside me or if you just watched it and got some inspiration, I know that I honestly just like to sit and watch cleaning videos and it's just very relaxing for me. So I hope that I was able to do the same for you. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, and if you like the video, go ahead and click that like button so I know to keep making videos like this, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!